Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. With several Bachelor Nation relationships ending, fans are wondering if Charity Lawson, Dot, and Olubeko are still together. Here's the latest on the season 20 Bachelorette Charity Lawson and her final rose recipient. In August, Charity Lawson and Dotan Olubiko descended on Las Vegas for a blowout birthday bash for Olubiko's 31st birthday. He took to his Instagram to share a snapshot of the two cuddled up with the caption, birthday wishes and engagement kisses. Lifestyle reports that the two celebrated at the Venetian on August 22, two days after viewers watched them get engaged on the Bachelorette finale. Following the trip to Vegas, the newly engaged couple were spotted looking glum at the U.S. Open in New York City. So are they still together? Charity Lawson took to her Instagram to dispel any rumors of trouble in paradise. She shared several photos looking cozy with her fiancé during a night out, dance partner for all. She captioned the post. The photo below makes it clear that they are still very much together and engaged. However, you can't blame Bachelor Nation fans for wondering. After all, this summer has seen longtime couple Caitlin Bristowy and Jason Tardick end their engagement. Furthermore, all signs point to a split between Bachelor and Paradise couple Danielle Maltby and Michael Alio. So, what's next for Charity Lawson and Dotan Olubico? Charity Lawson will be spending a lot of time in Los Angeles as a contestant on season 32 of Dancing with the Stars. She's based in Charlotte, North Carolina, while her fiancé lives in Brooklyn, a borough in New York City. However, during a recent appearance on the podcast here for the right reasons, she revealed that Olubiko will stay with her in LA during her time on the dance competition. On August 24, Lawson was a guest on Bachelor Nation's Bachelor Happy Hour podcast. While there, she opened up about their future plans for their living arrangement. According to Charity Lawson, she'll be moving from NC to NYC. She said, we are looking to move in together soon. We don't have a set date right now, but it's in the works. Another thing in the works is the happy couple's wedding. She said shortly after the finale that they don't want a long engagement. Click here to read more about their wedding plans. Are you relieved that Charity Lawson and Dotun Olubiko are still together? Share your thoughts in the comments below. Don't miss more former Bachelor Nation stars look for a second chance at Love on Season 9 of Bachelor in Paradise, premiering on ABC on Thursday. September 28 at 9 p.m. Eastern Time. Chase Chrisley and his sister, Savannah, talked about his split from Emmy Metters and he might try out for The Bachelor. Mind you, she suggested on her podcast that he should consider The Bachelorette. That definitely doesn't suit him. Anyway, after what he said about women, he might not have thousands of contestants applying even if he makes it to the ABC show in August. The news arrived that since Emmy and Chase split, he's thinking about dating again. That came when he did an interview on Extra TV. At the time, he said that he was ready to go for it in the dating scene. The former member of Chrisley Knows Best on the USA Network also made out that he had a lucky escape from Emmy, and for that, he's grateful. This week, he talked about Emmy and dating when he appeared on his sister's podcast. Chase Chrisley and Savannah said some pretty nasty things about Emmy. He mentioned that he drank alcohol and said some bad things and that things went sour. Meanwhile, Savannah spoke about how she dug into Emmy's social media and not liking what she saw. They clashed, however. They said a lot of other things. For instance, they discussed fame and how hard it is to date. And they mentioned people who don't have money. So critics thought they shaded Emmy as being a gold digger. He also talked about how his parents being in prison stressed the couple's relationship. Entertainment Tonight wrote about the Unlocked podcast where the siblings talked about Emmy and love, or the lack thereof. When Savannah's brother spoke about Emmy's family, it became clear that he wouldn't ever get back with Emmy again. The outlet cited him as saying, if they needed me, I would be there for them today. Would I ever get back with her? Not a chance in hell because I've seen too much. I've seen true colors. Next, they talked about him finding love on ABC's The Bachelor. Chase Chrisley ruled out The Bachelorette when Savannah suggested it. For viewers, he came over as a bit arrogant. He said, I'm already famous. I don't need to do it for fame. I want the love. Additionally, he claimed to be too toxic for the show. Well, he could be right about that. Social media buzzes with angry people who like Emmy. Still, he would consider The Bachelor, Chase Chrisley told Savannah, I would go on The Bachelor. However, if he did go on there, every applicant better be older than him because he's open to a sugar mama. Notably, 
they probably need a massive bank balance. He told Savannah that he's not cheap. Further, he said, I have dated some broke chicks, he added, and there's nothing worse than some broke chicks sitting there screaming and bitching. What do you think of Chase Chrisley saying that he wouldn't mind being on The Bachelor? What about him admitting he's toxic? Do you think he'd get many takers if he appeared on ABC? Share your thoughts with us in the comments below. And keep coming back for more Chrisley news. Always on top of the latest Hollywood celebrity gossip and drama. Subscribe to our channel and stay tuned for more videos and updates.